I swear on everything I know in love right now. No! Okay, I'm gonna be honest. This, I'm recording this literally 30 seconds after I recorded the last episode. So, because I'm just, I'm just, you know, I'm too invested right now. We gotta get back in it. So we're, we're going back in the class trial. The last episode, we did some investigating. And now it's show, it's, it's show time for real. We're about to see what's up. This, this is, it's the red door, right? Hey, I'm feeling black. Now that I have taken the greatest shit known to man, I am not ready to read and stutter for over two hours straight. Uh-oh, Rebecca, come back. Whoop. There she is. Ah, Kaide, I have one more question. My stomach don't hurt no more. Do you really think it's one of us? Not just the culprit, but the mastermind as well? Huh? Huh? Isn't that what you told me, Shibishi? Uh, yes, okay. but it's just that was only my deduction. I don't know if I should trust that. Hmm. Well, I don't know if it's true either. That's why we need to confirm it. If you just d dismiss a possibility and look the other way without confirming anything, yeah. then you're just turning your back on the truth. What's the matter? Shuichi, you seem so sure of yourself during the investigation. Sorry. Let's go. I'm sure they're waiting for us inside. I'm so scared, bro. I don't need any of them dying. Man, what the hell is this dumbass? Oh my god, dude. What? So this is the Shrine of Judgment? Everyone! Careful, everyone. If bad things happen, get behind... If bad things happen, get behind Gonta. Yoo-hoo! Then give me a piggyback ride. Yoo-hoo! Come on, can't... Bitch! Oh my gosh, you are so freaking annoying. So, are we doing this class trial here or what? No. No, Monokuma make it, made it sound like we'd be guided somewhere from here. That is trouble. But Monokuma is nowhere to be seen. What's going on? What the hell is this? This Monokuma statue, statue gives us such off a, like gives off such a weird vibe. All right, here we go. Huh? What? Let's get it going. What? Who builds this shit, man? Like, come on, bro. Who builds this? Like. Showtime, bruh. Oh, the elevator, just like in um Monaco or the uh the mountains. They go they go from in the mouth and down like the uh, elevator. Okay, is this an elevator? This is. This, he want us to board it? Oh. I don't wanna. I don't do scary rides. <gasps> I don't want to get on it either. Hmm. Stay behind them, though. I'm sure that'll just be worse for you in the end. I guess. Yeah, that's true. I know. If you desire. However, if everyone wants, wishes to run away, I will cooperate as well. No. That's probably not a good idea. There's nowhere to run. As long as that end wall exists, escape's not an option. Hey. It'll be fine. Let's all work together. Remember our promise? We're going to escape this place and remain good friends afterwards. I'll get us out of here. So let's do it. I'm sure we'll be all right. Mm-hmm. Let's go, Kaide. Because we make such an incredible team. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to call myself a man if I was still scared after hearing a girl say that. Bring it! I'll show them how I live. Don't you mean die? Dumbass! Don't say something all ominous like that. I'm ready. We've come so far already. We just gotta do it. So let's do it. Okay. We have no choice. We can't turn back now. Man. Let's get it going. Determined, we all stepped forward. Even as we walked towards the elevator, I was shaking with anxious dread. But I kept going because I decided to fight. And everyone had boarded the elevator. Damn, bro. It's, about, it's really about to start, man. Oh, boy. Here we go. Damn, they even got this. Oh, that's super cool. It's actually an elevator. Even so. This elevator is going pretty far down. <laughs> We're falling. I wonder how far we will plummet. 
Uh, I suddenly have to go to the bathroom real bad. By all means, go ahead. Of course. Huh? A robot wouldn't understand how inappropriate that is. As we waited to reach our destination, I whispered to Shuichi. Um, Shuichi? About that talk from before. What? <laughs> what? I think everyone is afraid of learning the truth. But the people who are willing to mm. find the truth are the ones who can decide their fate. If you never know the lies from the truth, then you can't choose a path. You won't even know you're on a path. Mm. So, fight for the truth. Even if it is frightening. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! I know you can do this. If you're scared, Borrow the strength of others who will be there to help you. Think of everyone you're helping, and let that be your strength. Why is she saying this like she's going to die? I used to be like you. Before a piano concert, I was always so nervous that I thought I would vomit. But then I would remember all the people I've made smile with my performances. Kaede. Alright, let's go. It's better to end bad stuff like this as soon as possible. Words were mainly for me, or mainly for me, and inspired me, so I would not turn back. Oh my gosh, why did I just... After some time, the elevator finally came to a halt. The door slowly opened to reveal what awaited us on the other side. Ooh, look at this. Why, hello, Bear! Welcome to the Clash Trials! Yay! Oh boy, the Clash Trials is finally starting! Finally, a game that actually feels like a game. Bingo! Just as the it's getting longer. Just as the proper the prophecy foretold. Got it. Listen up. From here on, things are gonna get so violent you wish you would you could turn back. No way. But that's not true. There won't be any gory or violent scenes. I'm positive. This is. This is an this is an authentic replica of a courtroom. <laughs> what a bad what bad taste. Ah, oh, jeez. Why are you making us do this? Is this fun for you? I know it. I know it. Literally, a pop. literally appearing from nowhere. Of course, putting strangers in a life or death situation or scenarios is the best entertainment. You're the worst what? of the worst. <laughs> worst or not, those who have fun are the real winners in this world. It doesn't matter what terrible things you do or or are done to you, as long as you're having fun. Oh, I see. Wow, this is so sickening, it's almost refreshing. So how do we get this game going? Well, now. There are pon is poniums over there. Please stand behind the one with your name on it. Mm. Ooh! They gonna play this song? They gonna play this song? As I walked towards my podium, an image of his body flashed in my mind. Oh, I should have ended that episode right there! Damn, but here, here we starting it. Let's go. Let's go. We starting it right now. Job without knowing his own ultimate talent. I like this remix. No, he was murdered by some horrible lowlife scumbag. I'll never forgive his killer. That's why we're going to expose this, the mastermind here in, in this killing game. That's all I can do for Rentar right now. Mm, let's go. His killer is in the room with us. The mastermind who's controlling Monokuma and forcing us to play this game. Hold up, actually, let me do something real quick. I, I was just trying to figure out how to remove the text. There we go, there we go. That's so cool. I don't think I'll ever be fully prepared to find out who that person is. Mm. But we have to find out who it is so we can lift our suspicious suspicions of each other. Mm, mm. That's it right there. That's it right there. So we can end this killing game. That's why I'm here. I can't show any fear here. I must fight to the bitter end. I will face this life or death class trial. Mmm. Mmm. And they gave me the option to save, bro. Mmm. Oh, it's showtime. It's showtime. I don't have any skills, do I? Increase maximum influence a little. Extraordinary focus. Effective during the parse. Okay. Do I have anything? I have. Okay, okay. Alright, those are we going. That's what we got so far. Let's get it going. 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 Class trial number one. Ahem. Now 
Now oh, look at this UI. Let's begin with the basic explanation of the class trial. Mm -hmm. During the trial, you'll present your arguments for who the culprit is and vote for who done it. Vote correctly, and only the blackened will be punished. Mm -hmm. But if you pick the wrong person, I'll punish everyone besides the blackened, and that person will graduate from this academy. Also, refusing to vote will result this in your death. crazy. So you better vote for someone. Now let's get this crazy awesome, crazy awesome trial underway. So, it's starting, huh? Mm. <laughs> oh, man. I haven't been in a trial in, like, forever. So he's been in one. Oh, so you have experience with trials? Yeah, <laughs> since I'm a leader of evil and stuff, <laughs> I've done a lot of bad things. What the hell is this problem? So, what are we supposed to do? Where do we even start? Gonta never done trial before. Not sure where to begin. <laughs> First, let's breathe in and breathe out. We need to remember our no, no, no's. What? No pushing, no running, no talking. But communication is the foundation of any discussion. Right, what are we doing? We should not worry about our procedure, especially since this is not a normal trial. Each of us will be serving as a potential culprit, lawyer, mm -hmm. prosecutor, and jury member. Let us proceed with that in mind, shall we? Mm. Then might I offer the first topic? Okay. Don't fucking get ahead of us. You trying to start some shit? Okay, she about to go nuts. She about to go nuts. Calm down. How about we listen first? Look Have at this big ass listen? dude. He says, oh, my bad. I didn't I'm a that. good listener because my ears are clean. Once I clean them so hard, they bled. What is her problem? I'll begin the conversation then. It's about to start. There's something I found curious. Why, I wonder, didn't the culprit take advantage of the first blood perk? Mm -hmm. I thought that was strange too. I bet they just wanted Why did he jump to do in the back? last trial real bad. Then Monokuma's the culprit, the doy. Because this whole class trial was his idea. M me, you come on now. Lock in. Lock in. Yeah! Easy peasy. I'm a fucking genius. Lock in, me, you lock in. Wait, is it even possible for Monokuma to be the culprit? It's not. He never killed. Like, uh, to start something. Of course else. not. Yeah. I would never do anything to you guys directly. Even if you can't, it's a different story for the person controlling you, right? Hmm? Mm. Is it possible that the mastermind controlling Monokuma killed Rantaro? Mastermind? What's that? <laughs> this dude, bro. I don't know any mastermind. Never heard of him. Don't play dumb with me. Who's the mastermind mm. controlling you guys? The mastermind, huh? Odds are. It's one of us. This dude don't belong here, bro. It's way over here. Not no everyone else thinks so too. Does everyone really think that? Oh. We'll get to the bottom of this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this dude, bro, I can't. With this Before little... we determine the mastermind, we must uncover the culprit. Right. Then we could start by determining the sequence of events. Let's take a closer look at the circumstances of Rantaro's death. Right. Gonta agrees with Shuichi. After all, Shuichi is ultimate detective. Then let us start by reviewing the incident. Mm. All right, let's do this. What we, what can we find the mastermind if we... Or we can find a mastermind if we work together. When this class trial is over, we'll know exactly who the mastermind is. And now, the class trial has begun. As things proceed... Let's focus. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, why does it show that the Xbox controller? If I'm, if I'm on computer and mouse, I hit my nose. Is that the you to, to unearth any lies or con contradictions in their statements? We have to use the truth bullets. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. I don't know what that means. And for gold words, those are the weak spots. Okay. There's a chance that the lies or contradictions are hiding within those weak spots. But remember, you might not be able to refute them all, and you have to use the right truth bullet compare everyone's statements to the truth bullets you have yep okay i know yep i know i know i know i know the new element during the trial you can concentrate to make time slow down 
This will reveal a small red dot within weak spots called the V point. If you hit that with the correct truth bullet, you'll get an awesome V counter. Bullseye. V counters really improve your score and the number of mono coins you earn, so try that out. During the non-stop debate, or not during the non-stop debate, options will bring up the controls. I don't know what button that is on the keyboard. Give them a look. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Whoa! Why are they moving? Okay. On the Kuma file with a book pace. Rantaro's body was found. Mm-hmm. Just before the time limit, right? He was killed in the library. Mm-hmm. Rantaro was alone in the library. Uh-huh. The culprit could have snuck up on him. Mm-hmm. What was he even doing in the library anyway? Go, mm -hmm. He was opening that moving bookcase for one reason. Because he knew about the hidden door. Okay. That means Rantaro was masterminding this whole thing. No, 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 yep, no, I know what it is. That means Rantaro was masterminding this whole thing. Nope, nope, nope. No, that's wrong. No, that's wrong. Oh! All right. Wait a minute. I don't think Rantaro was the mastermind. Hmm. Huh? Why? Because Rantaro didn't have the card key to open the hidden door. Right. You'd think the mastermind would have that card key on him, right? Perhaps the culprit took the card key after killing Rantaro. But none of the pictures show Rantaro holding the card key. Mm hmm So I don't really think he had the key at all. Right. Also, if the mastermind had died there, this killing game would have already ended. Right. You are correct. The possibility of him being the mastermind is quite low. Then how okay, Rantaro know about Hidden Door? Your big ass. Maybe he stumbled across it in the library. You know, like how Shuichi did. Or maybe the mastermind told him about it. Mm. What? Why would the mastermind tell him that? To lure Rantaro to the library and kill him. Mm. Does that mean the culprit and the mastermind are one and the same? Hmm. That does seem plausible. I don't think... Because I know... You already know who I think it is. I'm not going to say it right now, but... I don't think that person would be like, I don't know. I don't think it would be them. It's very likely the mastermind hmm. knew about Kaede and Shuichi's trap. I wonder the how. The mastermind knew about our trap this whole time. This case may have become the perfect crime thanks to your hidden cameras. Hmm. The mastermind knew about your trap and exploited it to commit their crime. Mm -hmm. So after the mastermind lured Rantaro and murdered his ass, right? They used Kai Idiot and Puichi's hidden cameras to arrange the perfect crime. Oh my gosh, girl! Did they really take advantage of our trap, though? Is this really the perfect crime? Are we in an unsolvable mystery? Nah, it's solvable. What are they doing, jumping in the back? Y'all don't see our little ugly asses end. now? Wait, don't give up that easily. We already know the culprit is the mastermind. We gotta work together to find the mastermind. Then we can end this killing game. Right. You yap about teamwork and all that, but you still think one of us is the mastermind. Yes, and I know that's a horrible thought. But that's why I wanna end all the terrible things happening to us. I'll defeat the mastermind and end this dumb killing game. I'll. I'll even use this class trial to get do confident, that. Get confident, get confident, get confident. <laughs> wow, looks like you're determined to face even a cold hard truth. Then here it comes, the cold hard truth. What are you about to blurt out? You f what? Huh? What? I already figured out who killed Rantaro. Oh my gosh, dude. What? <laughs> even he don't know what's like, uh, uh, hold up. Um. Why are you surprised? Cause if he's right, that would make this the fastest class trial to date. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't give How up the answer. Fast was the previous record anyway? Real fast, let me tell you. He was like a leaf on the wind. What are they, who oh, are they yeah. talking about? I guess now he's one with the wind. Yeah, I think about him this time of year too. I wonder who they talking about. It's definitely somebody from the first game because no one from the second game died other than Shiaki. The way he soared through the enemy fleet, oh, badass! 
just to die like a little punk. Shut it, you weirdos. This is an important conversation. Kokichi, are you serious about knowing who the culprit is? Mm. Yep. So, we all agree that the culprit knew about Kaede and Shuichi's trap, right? Mm -hmm. No shit! That's why they're not in any of the pictures. So who is it? So whoever knew about the hidden cameras is the culprit. So who the hell is it? <laughs> it's you! Don't do this to her. What? She said, moi. You made the cameras used for the trap. It's not, right? it's not me. It can't be. It can't be. She has an alibi. Obviously, he was all the way upstairs. Whoever made the cameras knew about the blind spots. Before breakfast was the only time someone would be able to sneak by. Hmm. What, what the hell brought this on all of a sudden? I, I just designed the cameras. I didn't know they'd get set up in the Yeah, we library. didn't, we didn't tell her that. We didn't tell her that. If someone asked me to make cameras, I totally ask what they were for. How come you never asked what the cameras were for? Huh? Huh? <laughs> I, I I pulled an all nighter making them and afterward just sort of passed out. Mm hmm You're getting awfully worked up. Look at you. You're sweating. I'm always wet. Huh? I'm just feeling extra sensitive, like these big boobs of mine. What? Spike! What do you got? Someone's what? so aggressive. You're kind of a wimp, huh, me? Come on, pull me up the hook already. D do you want money? Is that it? Yeah, she definitely reminds me of Macan, bro. Your pathetic excuses are consistent. All right, get off her. Chill out, her. Chill out. Mm-hmm. Is that really okay? Yeah. Uh, Non-stop debate. Agree. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's get it going. Now we gotta figure out what we can agree with her on. Card duster. Why don't you just admit it already? You're the culprit, aren't you, Mew? No way. That's not possible. Um, card so duster. So nothing about the trap in the library? No, no. I'm telling you, I had no idea. What's Koriko's account? Like it matters. I never went to the library, okay? Hmm. The person who made the cameras. Would have known their blind spots too. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. Okay. 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 I okay. didn't make the cameras either. Okay. 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 I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. To the library. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. She never did. She never did. She never did. She never did. I agree with that. Yep. Yep. She never did. She was in the uh, the the lunch room. She was in the dining hall the whole time until they were told. I don't think Mew went to the basement either. Right, Kyo? Of course she didn't. Mm. Mew was in the dining hall during the murder. Right. I saw her there while dining on what I thought would be my last supper. <laughs> the pasta on the menu tastes like a lonely Yo, old shut lady your eyes eating her up. kid's birthday cake. Don't feel bad for her. She got to eat her tasty grandkid on his birthday. That's too sad to make sense. That's pops. What are they talking? So there okay. you have it. Muse alibi. Right. The fucking slug? Why didn't you say so earlier? Good job, Kaede. Guess I shouldn't have judged you by your lackluster rack. Why are you judging my tits? What Gilgamesh I'm... level condescension? <laughs> but which Grail War are you from? What? Wow, another reference we don't get. <laughs> you must be a hardcore loser. Damn! Oh, sorry. Sometimes my hobbies just sort of slip in. Mm hmm. Hey! Don't be acting all cocky, Kokichi. You put my ass in the hot seat earlier. Right. How about you just keep your fucking mouth shut, you lying little abortion? Damn! What? That, that was really uncalled for. I only said that to find the culprit. <laughs> You're so mean! What's up with... Hey, I feel a lot better now. What's his problem, y'all? That's kid. What is he looking at? He's looking at Miku <laughs> or Maki. Samugi and Kirumi were both in the dining hall as well. Mm -hmm. We right. can dismiss those four as potential culprits right. if they were together the entire time. No, not the entire yep. time. Yep, yep. Samugi went to the point, restroom. Samugi went to the restroom. Right. Oh, so you brought that up after all? Oh no. What's... It's true. I went to the restroom closest to the dining hall. Mm-hmm. Oh? Did I hear that right? 
The restroom, you say? Did he catch a lie? Excellent! I was waiting for this moment. I'm getting so excited. But Monica, right he right wouldn't now. reveal a lie. He wouldn't reveal that. Unless. No. Why? Oh my gosh, that face. Did you take a firm dump, or was it a soft one? Why are you assuming she was dropping a deuce in there? But I really did just go to the restroom, not the basement, you know? True, because... Yeah, yeah, that's true. Also, I don't think I was there long enough to be suspicious, right? Mm -hmm. You're the ultimate cosplayer, though. Right. You could have just disguised nope, yourself she can't do that. She can't do that. She can't do that. She can't do that. Disguised? No, no. I don't do disguises. She can't do that. I don't think that's possible, and I know the reason why. Right. Cost box, yep. I'm trying to... It wouldn't okay. let me do it. Okay. Sumugi can only cosplay as fictional characters. Mm -hmm. That's what cosplay is supposed to be in the first place. Lately, some people prefer to cosplay as non-fictional characters, mm -hmm. which is unforgivable. It's so unforgivable that I break out in Cospox if I even attempt Cospox. I just noticed, I just got that joke. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah, Spike. The Cospox was pretty gross. I see. If that's the case, then there's no way you could have been in disguise. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that, Samugi. I just thought it was something to check. <laughs> His voice, bro, is killing me. Oh, no, me. it's fine. I'm not bothered by it at all. All right. Aw, Samugi is so nice. She's way better than you. Mm. Well, fuck you too. Oh my gosh, dog. Getting back on topic, we now have alibis for the people in the dining hall. All right. So we know that Kirumi, Samugi, Mew, and Kyo can't be the culprits. I like the little, the, um, the jury hammer at the bottom. Every time you click next or to the next dialogue option or next dialogue, it like hits the thing. Look, see, it's cute. Congratulations what? to the four of you. You can all leave now. Nah. -uh. <gasps> can they? So what about the swines who went to the basement? They're all suspicious, right? Mm. Which of us went to the basement? Why is he getting well, over when Shuichi and I were on lookout, we saw... Mm -hmm. Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Himiko, Angie, and Rantaro. So, seven oh, people in total. He said, his, he said his name. So the culprit is among those seven? Right. <laughs> but of course! Why are you laughing? That includes you too! One of the six people headed to the basement. The mastermind of this killing game? The person who's making us all or making us endure all these these terrible things? Why not torture the truth out of them? It would be the quickest method. Mm. No, Wait, Rico. Please! <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry, I'm My sorry. My tolerance for pain is actually really, really low. I'll tell you everything! Anything! Just please don't hurt me! What? Please just tell us what happened. If the culprit is among that group, then wouldn't Maki be the most suspicious? Just look at her. She could definitely kill someone. That's crazy. Are they putting that like whole idea on so her? Stupid. The culprit could easily be anyone, like Kaito. Then what are you talking about? Yeah. There's no way what I'm is the that? Why does he Who's keep? Who's the culprit? Who? Gonta is gentleman. Gentlemen not hurt people. It's not Whatever, me bro. either. Murder sounds like way too much work. Yeah, she just had to get killed. I have an killed. alibi. Who's the culprit for fuck's sake? We need to calm down. If everyone talks all at once, then we can't discuss anything. Mm. It's Talk, right, Kaide. Kaide. Talk your shit, Kaide. We just need to listen to everyone's statements. You can do this, right? Yeah, I got this. Listen to everyone's statements. I could pick out everyone's voices as they talk over each other. I only went because I was invited. Why don't you ask the shady guy who invited you? Mm -hmm. What? You mean me? But I just said this it wasn't mechanic? me. Don't thrust the blame on me, you degenerate males, and you're thrusting. Ugh. Yeah, something definitely happened to her, man. Not a bad girl, really. If you don't believe me, ask my mom. Really? I have an alibi. I am the culprit too. Hmm. Okay. Oh no, three people are talking at once. Everyone is cl okay, cl cl clamoring to prove their innocence. There's a panic in the courtroom. 
Oh, that's right. This time, you will now be thrown into a mass panic debate. Weak spot. Okay. Three, okay, just run con, just like the non spot. We sort through everyone's opinions and find a lie or contradiction and refute it. You can also use the V counter if you're confident. Give that a shot. Try to take your time. Okay. Okay. This is crazy. Receive it. Receive on Shushi Library event. I have an alibi. I'm a little bit suspicious. I would never punch a pope. A true Aikido master would never do something so shameful. Who's that talking about me? Punching is permitted in Aikido? Remember, Rantaro's the only one who left in the middle of it. Uh huh. Like Kibo, none of us there could have killed him. Right. Okay. All different voices of Kibo. Kaido's statement was suspicious, right? I'll be fine as long as I stay calm. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, okay. My brave man. What? Are you talking about Okay, okay, I think I got it. Right. There we go, there we go, there we go. See? I got it, I got it! <laughs> okay. Wait a minute, Kaito. Wasn't there someone else who disappeared other than Rantaro? Let's get it. Yep. Let's get to the meat. Let's get to the meat. Gonta also left during the strategy meeting. Yeah, he locked himself up in the he AV about to snap. room. Gonta about to snap. Hey, wait a sec, idiot! Is that right, Gonta? Y yes, Gonta watched Bug Movie to fill Gonta with fight, so Gonta can fight Monokuma. Yeah, that, I already know that's a lie because the damn thing wasn't on and there was no movie inside the thing. So. Were you trying to imagine yourself as a huge mantis with swords for hands? So my Star Wars. Oh, come on! How is looking at bugs supposed to put you in a fighting mood? A terrible idea. Like putting ketchup on a hot dog. But Man, what the hell are they talking about? Cause Gonta need focus. Hmm? Everyone suspect Gonta? Why? Because you don't have an alibi. You don't. Oh, Gonta just need alibi? Okay. Gonta will get alibi. Just tell Gonta where to find it. Mm, the way right. this debate is going, this will be difficult to refute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what will you do? Without an alibi, we'll all choose you. Gonta, please understand that in order to reveal the truth, right? This, he don't know nothing. But Gonta, not sure where to start. You just have to tell everyone why you couldn't have done it. Mm-hmm. If you're not the culprit and we all vote for you, then we're dead too. Right. Our lives are riding on your word. You got this. <laughs> I like him, bro. See? Okay. Gonta will try. For everyone's sake. Why is he like flexing his like what is his, what is his stance? Fight, Gonta! Fight! 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 Cut it out, you fucking bobblehead! Oh my gosh! They're basically getting loud and heated, but I need to focus on everyone's voice. And hopefully we can expose the mastermind. Let's get it going. You doing this again? Okay. Non-stop debate. Okay, okay, okay. This is this. Alright. But moving bookcases, car reader, Rentaro's belongings. Not culprit. Cause to leave A V room. Gonta must walk through game room where friends are. To mm -hmm. even reach hallway. Okay. It's probably a sliding if you door. Can't get to the hallway. Okay. You can't go to the library. Right. AV room's got more than one entrance, though. It does. There should have been a door facing the hallway, too. Right, but that one was broken, though. The sliding door across from the rear entrance, correct? Mm-hmm. With that sliding door... Boom. Yep, I got it. No, that's wrong. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Put me in the game, coach! It's not possible to use the sliding Dang door. Dang it, roll before. Put me in. Don't. Don't do that. You say Got a lot of ass to be contradicting me. Dude. Did you mean to say sass? I am. Um, think you left out an S. <laughs> the sliding door always mm -hmm. jams. You're only, only with enough a crack. Hold up. Only with enough space to fit a baseball, like she said. The only part of your body that would be able to go through is your arm. And there was no indication of the door being forced. There was dust on the track. In other words, the chance they came out the sliding door is zero. That is true. That's true. Uh, I see. So, I made a mistake. How rare. 
Girl. It's not that rare for you to make a mistake. Your entire existence is a mistake. What? Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Vicious little. If Gonta couldn't use the sliding door, then in order to get to the library, you'd have to go through the game room. But I didn't see him at all. Mm -hmm. See? Gonta tell you he not culprit. All right, bro. All right. <laughs> We cannot yep, confirm that. Yep, let's yet. get it to be. Huh? My apologies, Gonta. I do not mean to put you on the spot like this, but because I promise to do my best, I will. I don't need here to die. I don't need here to die. I don't need here to die. Keep her alive, Are you please. Saying Gonta could still be the culprit. There is the possibility that Gonta killed Rantaro from the AV room. From the yep. From the AV room. How? Uh -huh. I didn't know that was a possibility. Not only could he have killed Rantaro from the AV room, but also oh. he would not appear in any of the pictures from the cameras placed mm -hmm. in the library. Yep, he didn't need to. He didn't need to kill him from there. He didn't need to kill him in there. I'm trying to tell you, because he couldn't get out Whoa, anyway. Perfect. Either way. But wait, then how did Gota kill him? Well, it's obvious to this glamorous girl genius. But maybe explain for these dimwits. First, Are you one of the dimwits? Explain the layouts of both the AV room and the library. Mm -hmm. the look, look, door yep, in the right AV there. Room faces the rear door Ooh, of the library. But wait, wasn't the the slot wasn't the bookshelf door open, so it was kind of blocking that view? Uh oh, hold up, I might be wrong. Because of this, it is possible for Gonta to have killed Rantara while he was in the AV room. Mm -hmm. Um, but how though? In order for the murder to take place, the rear door of the library must be open. Which it was. Oh, wait a sec. Isn't that impossible? The AV room sliding door doesn't open, so you can't get into the hallway. Like she said, I'm trying to tell you, a ba like a she said, a baseball can fit in there. The little the little if slide. You enter the hallway. How would you open the rear door to the library? Although you cannot fit your whole body through the sliding door, an arm would suffice. It would be possible if you used a particular item in the AV room. Mm -hmm. Yep, I know exactly what that is. Ooh. Uh, oh shoot. Um, a particular item? Maybe this? What if you saw the posters? No, that's not it. I don't know, but it would not be durable enough. Oh, okay. Or this? What is it? I don't know! What item would have been used to open the rear entrance to the library? Um, I don't know. I really don't know. What else did we see? The couch? I get it. Now, how? Explain that. Cause is I it the projector screen? How? Oh, she did say roll it up. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that. That is correct. You can make a long pull if you roll up the screen. All right. It would be possible to reach the library door with it. If you use the rolled up screen to reach the library's rear door. Then you can open it. What? I can't tell if my mind is blown or I'm just like, the I don't know. The screen itself is right. quite heavy, but that would not have been a problem for Gonta. Yeah, no problem for Gonta. Oh my, how honest. Okay. But if you open the library door, the camera would take your picture. Uh, actually, the camera wouldn't be triggered just by opening the door. Someone would have to walk through it. Shuichi and Kaede's pictures were like that as well. The shutter only went off when someone set foot into the room. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it was possible to open the library door, but where does that get us? Gonta still couldn't have gotten from the AV room to the library. Gonta did not enter the library. He killed Rantara while he was still in the AV room. I'm going to kill Rantara in the, in the library. That means while he was on the AV room then. So does that mean Gonta threw the shot football? Mm. Wait, wait, I say. Why would anyone 
do something so crazy like throw a... Wait! That's actually not crazy what at all! His face? Throwing a shot put ball is totally normal! Yes, the act of throwing a shot put ball could lead one to use it as a weapon. She killing it right now, man. She facing to the right. I... Even if a person couldn't fit through the space, a shot put ball certainly would. Mm. Rentaro's body was across from the AD room sliding door as well. But why would he kill him though? As long as the rear door of the library was open, he would have been able to hit the victim. Mm -hmm. That's quite the distance though. It is, but only he'll be able to do that. That's the point. And that shot put ball was pretty heavy. You see how he's not saying nothing? Yep. Did you forget already? Don't it easily. That's the point that I made in the other video. Especially with that it line. Would definitely be feasible for him to throw a shot put ball at his target. Especially with that line where she was like, um, or Kade was like, he threw it five yards. I'm like, yards? Well, that was really specific. It could have been like feet. But yards? Nah. Off nope. rip. A walking talking Roomba can't compare to a mighty beast like Gonta. That Roomba remark is probably not about me. As what? I have a variety of custodial functions. What? Well, Gonta, can you throw a shot put ball from that distance? Yes, probably. You're too honest, Gonta. Mm. <laughs> You're so cool, Gonta. You could be the ultimate shot putter. Well, I've heard enough. Gonta's the culprit. Mm. Wait, Gonta never hurt anyone, not even insect. Gonta telling truth. Gentlemen never tell lies. Is he about to snap and kill us all? <laughs> well, there you have it. What do you guys think? I would like to believe him, but without evidence, we cannot. Mm. If everyone's wrong, we'll never find the mastermind. I can't let that happen. I need to do my best to guide everyone to the right answer. What's about to happen? Oh no. Not the debate. Alright. Okay. So we agree. Gonta's the culprit. Gonta not culprit. Honest. A typical degenerate male excuse. Okay. Taro's corpse in the AV room door. Do line up with one another. Is that just stylized? What is this? There are no obstacles in the way. Nope. Nope. Right there. Boom. No, I, I pointed not. that out earlier. been impossible for Gonta to have thrown that shot from the AV room because there was an obstacle between Rentaro and right. Gonta. Right. Obstacle. That's like one thing that contradicts my whole like prediction. So I don't really know where we can go from here. Case, when Rentaro was killed, it should have been open. Yep, that's our evidence. The bookcase door was open when he was killed. Wait, what? What proves that the bookcase is open? Yeah. I get it. Mm -hmm. It's in this picture. Here, look. Yep, yep, that These one. These two That's pictures the were taken by the camera facing the moving bookcase. These photos were taken moments before Rantaro was killed. The bookcase door is completely open here, and then it closes automatically. Mm-hmm. So but by the time we entered the library, the door had already closed know. itself. Before Rantaro was killed, the bookcase door was open. Mm -hmm. Even if Gonta did throw the shot, it would have hit the bookcase it instead. Yep, that's what I'm saying. So how did he get hit? Uh, excuse me. Damn. <laughs> I see. Well, that pretty much shuts the book on that theory then. If that's true, then there's no possibility that Gonta is the culprit. I don't know about no possibility, but that lessens what? the possibility. Why are uh, you making this so complicated? Just be the culprit. She's still already. making that funky ass face. Uh, sorry. I don't think you need to apologize. Yeah, that's right. A man shouldn't apologize so easily. Yep. She about to speak up. I should oh, be the one to apologize. I am sorry for accusing you, Gonta. No, going to understand, because we got to find culprit. Well said. Something. For a degenerate male, you're actually pretty Why reasonable. is she always like... <laughs> hey, man, you know, I don't know what happened. We got to figure it out. I hate 
this sentimental crap. Oh my gosh, what is your ugly ass? Why is that? It's nice when everyone gets along like this. You about to snap. Are you stupid or something? I can't stand people having a good time. Is that real? I don't know. I don't. Daddy is too evil to feel ashamed for being. We oh, could learn a lot from him. Don't mind me. I'm not actually taking notes. I'm placing bets on racehorses. I'm chosen for relief. Bro. Oh, 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 Good that Gont is in the clear, but don't break out the confetti just yet. Right. We're out of suspects now. On top of that, we still don't even know how Rantaro died. Right. So we only know what the weapon is? How are we supposed to find the mastermind with that? Hmm. We know the murder weapon is the shot put ball. But where did the culprit get Back of the head. I think it was from the warehouse. Oh, I, saw I thought you said wouldn't he get hit. Equipment there. Yeah, it was from the warehouse. Then anyone would have been able to obtain it. We need more information. And what's wrong, Shuichi? Huh? Uh, uh, it's nothing. Dude, speak up. What you gotta say? Uh, how do we find this darn culprit now? Hey, culprit! Quit hiding! Just be a man and fess up already! We don't even know if they're a guy or not, mm -hmm. right? We don't know that. Or if they're even human. Are you referring to me? Don't worry, you guys. We're one step closer to the truth, so don't give up. Try to remember what happened. We can find more clues left by the mastermind. Clues? What kind of clues? Like... If Rantaro he was right beside me, bro. If he won, he could just like, library, and I'll go flying. Maybe somebody saw Rantaro having a suspicious conversation with someone. It would be a good idea to figure out who knew about our trap. Mm -hmm. Either way, anything you guys remember might be able to help with the case. Yes, yes. But are you sure the culprit is also the mastermind? I don't know about that. Yeah, I think so. Why? I don't think that's the case, then Kaede. What that Tua just told me about how the culprit entered the library is correct. What? Huh? I didn't hear anything. Oh, that's right. Only I can hear the voice of a Tua. Then I will speak on the Tua's behalf as his prophet. Okay. If the culprit is the mastermind, they could have entered the library while avoiding the cameras. Hmm? What? Are you serious? What? There's a way to do that? Is it? I don't know. Super serious, brother. Yeah. Tua sounds like a shady weirdo. A way for the culprit to enter the library without being caught by the cameras. Is that really possible? Atua says... I should continue explaining on his behalf. Mm -hmm. Yep! Ha ha ha! Only Atua knows the truth behind this incident! So why can't... Oh no, oh no. Alright, let's get it going. Car reader desk, library vent, mocking the, the count. The was hiding in the library the whole time. Before Kaede and Shuichi even placed the cameras. Where would they have hidden? Inside the hidden door! That's so your oh, the culprit was mm -hmm. wait there. If that's true, the suspects are those who were alone at the time of the incident. The only ones who didn't go to the dining hall or basement are... Kokichi and Kibo and Ryoma, right? Mm. I knew the culprit was a male! Dude. Yeah Behold, Atua's divine life! I like this, this, that little splash art. I like that. I've never had to debate a god before. I can tell there's a contradiction, but I don't think Angie's noticed it yet. Boom. Yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go, no, there we go. That's wrong. Yep, because the car the desk on the car reader didn't was not off. It wasn't used at all. Okay. Wait a minute, Angie. I don't think it was possible to hide in the hidden door. I don't know why I thought she was talk I thought like at first she was talking about the vent, but nah, that's the hidden door. What? Like the genuinely the challenge hidden door. I don't think the hidden door was ever used. Right, Shui Shi. Huh? The dust is still there. It looks like the car reader wasn't used. That means the mastermind didn't hide here. Yep. While investigating the mastermind, I placed dust on the card reader. If anyone swiped their card key, oh, I can look around. Ugh. 
We already confirmed during the investigation that there was no dust on the floor. Mm -hmm. The bookcase hadn't been opened, so I doubt anyone was hiding in there. The fog has lifted. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> you still got a ways to go. <laughs> Why does he do this, bro? Why is he like this? Huh? W what do you mean? The culprit could have been in the library before the cameras were even set. That's a good... Okay. You won't be able to prove anything with weak reasoning like that. Contradicted? Yep. One-on-one -on -one debate with the rebuttal showdown. Example, let me show... Okay. Oof. All right, let's get it going. If this, I think it's the same, like... Okay, let's get it going. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, what's up? I'm going to come up five times by front entrance photos. Rick. Even if we rule out the hidden door, the library's okay. got no shortage of hiding spots. There's piles of books all over. Since the culprit was there before the cameras were, they could have been hiding there, you know? They took out Rantaro, then took off. Hmm. But if the culprit killed him and ran away, uh -huh. wouldn't they have been caught on camera? Right. Not if they went back into hiding. Right after killing Rantaro. Then, once everyone's gathered around the body, all they gotta do is act like they just ran in. We join everyone and we'd be none the wiser. Trying to see the holes on Yoma's argument. I have evidence I can present that will break down Yoma's argument. Rantaro. Then, once everyone's gathered around, all they gotta do is act like they just ran in. We join everyone and we'd be none the wiser. I'll cut your words! Okay, I have to explain that one because I don't understand that. Like, I mean, I. The I, culprit met him inside the library. That doesn't seem possible, though. Mm-hmm. Let's hear it then. What's your reason? Everyone ran out, or everyone ran in already. If you take a look at the three pictures from the camera we placed near the front door, this is when Shuichi and I met up with Kaito and Tenko, and then rushed in. This one shows the other four people running in after they heard Tenko scream. Mm -hmm. And finally, everyone else coming in after hearing the body discovery announcement. You can clearly see everyone entering the library in these pictures. Didn't wait. What? Okay. So what was the point of the argument? We already established it that. Make sense that. If there was someone hiding in the library the whole time. Well, that does cover everyone now. What does that have to do with anything? We just said the dust on the thing wasn't moved. So why? How would? What? What is he talking about? Who still has a ways to go? Is me. Shut your little ass. <laughs> no, bro. I don't. I don't know if that was just me or or what. But he was saying that. He's saying that he could have hid in there. But the only way to get in there is if you slide, if you, if you do the card reader, that means the desk will be off the card reader. That's like the whole, that's the whole con, the point where it was contradicted at. He was like, he could, he could have went out or he could have went out, killed him, ran out and then met up with everybody. That doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. I don't know what he was talking about. Don't worry about that was it. Dumb. It's better to think about each possibility anyway. Right, Shuichi? Yeah, uh, he only, hmm? Ah, um, yeah, yes. he don't even know what the hell going. He, he that just bewildered her his whole mind. I uh, is she, she, she is she, she okay? He's been really quiet. Is he worried about something? So the real question is how the culprit entered and exited the library. They did it. We cannot continue until we address that problem first. It's quite the mystery. How did the killer avoid mm -hmm. being caught by the cameras? Because he never went Almost in. Almost like they were invisible. Oh, but it wasn't me. My magic can only make you half invisible. What does that even mean? Your upper half, to be specific. That's kind of a half-baked invisibility spell, isn't it? But both doors to library had hidden cameras on them. How about the vent in the library? Maybe they came no. in through there. Mm -mm. Not possible. But Shuichi and I were on yep. lookout in the classroom with the connecting vent. The culprit waited until Kaede and Shuichi weren't looking, then turned invisible. Himiko is really gung ho about her invisible culprit theory. What is she talking about? Um, yeah, no. So, yeah, no uh, way no. someone snuck into the library through the vent. Kaede don't play with that. That's right. We have evidence that proves that would that would have been impossible. I 
combo event. Uh, class event, right? Yeah. There's no evidence anyone can use the class event. I was unable to confirm that. How are you able to run? Okay. The stacked books. Okay, I was looking for this. I was like, where is that at? It. Yeah. It's the stacked books. I was I was like, that's not an option. When I set the cameras, I also stacked some books in front of the vent. Mm hmm. If someone did crawl in and out from the vent, the books would have collapsed. Right. While we were investigating, they were still neatly stacked the way I placed them. Mm-hmm. Maybe they put the books back when they left the room. No, they didn't, because the ladder was that in the same... That would be quite difficult to achieve on such a narrow bookcase. Mm. If we've ruled out the vent and doors, then how'd the culprits get in and out of the library? Because they weren't ever in. Maybe... Divine intervention? What? Gonta no can think of any other way to enter. Eureka! I know how the culprit got in the library. The front door! Um, have you been paying attention? <laughs> don't give a damn the about this case. Would have taken their picture. Mm -hmm. Not if the culprit timed their movements around the camera intervals. Uh. Huh? Intervals? What is that? Basically, the culprit knew about the cameras and their intervals. So they snuck into the library between camera shots mm. to avoid appearing in the mm, photos. Okay, I was thinking about that. <laughs> I know, I know. Beauty and brains. Okay, all right. Why? It's just not fair. Mm-hmm. New? What's this interval you're talking about? Huh? Oh, now you're asking me. After the shutter snaps, the camera can't take a new photo for 30 seconds. Why does because she I redesigned the cameras to auto roll the film instead of having to do it manually. Yeah, she okay. She did do that. That's the first time I'm hearing about this. Right. Why didn't you tell us from the start? <laughs> oh my gosh. But, but I told your little beta boy toy after I gave you the remodeled cameras. What? Sh Shuichi? Uh, I'm I'm sorry. I I guess I forgot to tell you. Why? How could you forget to tell me? I didn't think it would affect the plan. I I didn't realize it would matter. I guess I How? forgot to mention it. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I forgot right. what? What, a what, pitiful that excuse. what? All right. Yeah, that's pretty much a lie. It has to be. N no, it's not a lie. He probably just forgot. There was so much going look on. Look at her trying to protect it, her man. I'm um, look. To forget, you know? Yeah. Let's put that aside for now and talk about the camera intervals. Each interval lasted for 30 seconds, correct, Mew? Yeah, sure. I'll explain it again to you mushheads. Mm -hmm. The three cameras that Kaidiot and Kuichi place go off when they pick up movement. From there, it takes 30 seconds for the film to auto-roll to the next photo. Mm -hmm. So, for 30 seconds, anyone could have entered the library without their photo being taken? Right. That may have been enough time to kill Rantaro and exit the library. Yeah, that is quick. It's definitely enough time. You just gotta move at lightning speed. I see, I see. Then there's no doubt the culprit made use of the camera's intervals. That means the culprit was Mew all along, since she knew about the intervals. Oh my gosh. Don't be an asshole! I have an alibi. Remember the dining hall? Mm hmm Oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> who else knew about the intervals? I don't... Hmm. Now, who was it again? He better point at Shuichi. Shuichi. Mm. Uh, Damn, they about to be on his ass. Does this mean that he is the culprit we have been seeking? Shuichi. Hey, what gives, Shuichi? Uh-oh. Shuichi would never do that. Right, Shuichi? I still think it's going to. I don't have a lot, I don't have a lot of evidence soon. beyond that point, though. Your silence only damns you further. Fess up already! Did you kill Rantaro? Uh. Hey, Shuichi. What's going on, my bro? What's up with him? Tell me you're gonna plead the fifth now. Oh my gosh, Shuichi. <laughs> oh man, this is getting good. Entertain me, peasants. No wait, Shuichi can't be the culprit. That's definitely wrong. There's no way. 
I refuse to believe Shuichi is the culprit. That's definitely not possible. Golly, bro. Golly, bro. What? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna finish. We're gonna finish this trial. Let's get it going. Well, now. They all have a theater? Oh hell nah. Oh no. I don't know who the culprit is, but I'm not paying attention, so it's okay. Yeah, but there's one thing we do know. The line between victim and attacker ain't as clear as you might think. Mm. I suppose that's one lesson we can take away from this case. I cut off the leg before the poison spread. What the hell? He been drunk for two episodes straight. From the stump. What the hell is his problem? And he's not saying nothing. All right, let's get back to it. Say something already. Your tongue-tied silence speaks volumes. I fucking knew you were the culprit. <laughs> what is? Wait, wait just a minute. None of. Oh my bad. Shuichi was I with me the whole else. time we were on lookout. Right. When are you suggesting Shuichi he killed He did leave Rantaro? me like twice, though. That's the thing, man. Were you really together the whole time? We were not. Not the whole time. Huh? What do you mean? I'm asking if you two were on lookout together. No, he went, the like a, he, he went downstairs for a second and came back up. Well, Excuse I me. guess we weren't together the whole time. Mm-hmm. I'm going to check the basement. I'll come with you. He says, stay here. No, you stay here and keep watch, Kaida. Yep. Oh, my gosh, dude. He's See, that's when Shuichi went to kill Rantaro. No, Shuichi wouldn't kill anyone. Don't become emotional. We must seek the truth in a calm and logical manner. Mm. Or all our lives will be lost here. I'm not being emotional here. I'm saying it with conviction. Mm. Even if Shuichi didn't go to the basement, he couldn't have killed Rintaro because... Yeah, the time... Yeah, the murder weapon. No, 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 no. Yeah, the, the security system didn't go it. off. They didn't... <laughs> Security alarm didn't ring until after Shuichi returned to the classroom. Right. It only rang after Rantaro moved the hidden door, which means he was still alive. Was there like a flash on the camera if or something? Shuichi was with me when the alarm went off, then that means he's not the culprit. By the way, I want to confirm one thing with you, Kaede. What show? Oh, never mind. Who set the security sensor on the bookcase? It was Shuichi, right? That face, bro. Oh, no. Did I set up the camera that's connected? To Why is Shuichi not saying nothing? I set it up carefully so that so the camera has a clear shot when, master, when the mastermind moved the bookcase. So let, let me take care of the security system on top of the bookcase. And we'll set the cameras near each door. Mm. Yeah. Shuichi was the one who set up the security sensor. Wait, how did he know that? About it. How the hell did he know that? Hold up! Did you actually check for yourself if the sensor was set on the bookcase, Kayede? No, I didn't check. Mm. Did it ever occur to you that Shuichi could have lied about setting the sensor? Hmm? Mm. A, a lie? Why is he not saying Shuichi nothing? Shuichi pretended to place the sensor on the hidden bookcase door. But in actuality, he was holding it the whole time. And when he met up with you, he secretly triggered the sensor to make the security alarm go off. Mm. That would cause Kaede to assume that someone had moved the bookcase. Mm. I see, sneaky little fucker. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why are you holding his heart? Just say something. No, at this rate, everyone's going to think Shuichi is the, is the culprit. I have to do something. I know for a fact that he's not the culprit. So I gotta do something. Oh no. White noise. Okay, yep, alright, yep, alright, cool. White noise, yep. Alright, let's get it going. Let's see when she rear entrance photos. The security sensor was armed, but the moving bookcase isn't what triggered it. As it turns out, Shuichi had it the whole time. The sound Kaede heard came from the sensor when Shuichi secretly moved it mm. in order to trigger the alarm. 
Okay. So when Kaede heard the sensor go off, she figured someone had tried to move the bookcase. Mm. Only an idiot can make that mistake. He's not saying anything. She should couldn't have the sensor on him. That's right, and I could, should have evidence that proves it beyond a shadow of a doubt. I think it's this. Is it what triggered it? Yeah. Okay. 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 No, that's wrong. Right. Wait a minute. This is weird. If the security sensor wasn't placed, then we wouldn't have been able to take that picture. Right. We were only able to get it because the sensor was triggered by the hidden door. Oh, that? Easy to explain. Well, you see... Uh... I guess Shut I your ass up! Sorry, I didn't think that far ahead. Don't get him up. You're giving up that easily? Oh my gosh, that face. Yeah... It's still I mean, there. Oh my gosh, is? why? I made a mistake. Big deal. You speak as if you knew that from the start. Even I was taken in. So you see? Shuichi can't be the culprit! Mm-hmm. Now wait just a minute. Oh my gosh, dude. The security sensor had a power supply. So what if it went like this? The security sensor was set up on the bookshelf, and Shuichi had its receiver. However, Shuichi turned the receiver off. Mm-hmm. Huh? How okay, I, 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 uh... That would get you a picture, but no alarm when Rantaro moved the bookcase. Then, when Shuichi says he's gonna check the basement, he actually goes to the library. And thanks to the 30 second interval, he's got time to go in after Rantaro. He could have collected the sensor from the hidden bookcase after killing Rantaro. No, no. I see. Then he caused the receiver to go off in front of Kaede to trick her. It's Why isn't he saying anything? Considering that Shuichi knew about the intervals. Uh, how needlessly complicated. But I guess it's not impossible. Is she a cat? She, Why is she, she so really is the culprit? Garfield all the time. I can't. So the ultimate detective is the killer. What a plot twist! Mm. Wait! Why do you guys think he's the culprit? Shuichi, please say something. Why aren't you saying anything? Why isn't he saying nothing? Shuichi. What the hell is going on? You're not. Hey, you gonna say anything? <laughs> we'll all vote for you if you don't. <laughs> And we are going to die. Are you okay with being the culprit? Are you ready to turn yourself in? What should I do? Everyone suspects Shuichi. There's no way he's the culprit, but even so. Uh, why won't Shuichi say something? Is there a reason he, he won't say anything? If that's the case, then it's all up to me. To protect everyone, I needed to take control of this debate. Even if it means I have to lie to do it. Huh? What? But sometimes necessary to hold on, dog. There will be times in a bait you have to lie. But before you before you had to refute the lies, but now you have to lie yourself. Okay, this is about it. This is confusing me a lot, dude. These mechanics right now are insane. And I don't know if I mean that in a good way or what. Let's go over the case one more time. The security sensor was placed on the moving bookcase. Shuichi also had the receiver. But he had it turned off. And so when Rantaro moved the bookcase, mm. a picture was taken without the alarm sounding. Then taking advantage I of the do that. timer. Shuichi hid in the library and murdered the shit out of Rantaro! No. And then he grabbed the security sensor from the bookcase. And return to the lookout spot. Afterwards, he set off the receiver in front of Kaede on purpose to make her think the murder had just happened. Praise be to Atua. We've solved this case. Oh my gosh, you wanna die? Case. Uh -huh. Shuichi also had the receiver. Boom. Okay. Let's turn this lie into the truth. Oh my gosh. Okay. What's he about to say? Because I don't understand. Sorry, that. you guys. I forgot to tell you something important. Forgot? <laughs> okay. To tell you the truth, it was me. I had the receiver. Huh? So that's why there's no way Shuichi could have turned off the receiver. 
Oh. He like. That is true. What the, the entire premise of the argument thus far is wrong. Is this true, Kaede? Uh, of course. Come on, would I lie to you guys? Yeah, she already knows. That only screw yourself over. If we mess up, you're dead too, you know. And if you mess up, we're dead too, you know, dumbass. What the? F or perhaps like, what do we? You wanted to cover for Shuichi, even at the cost of your oh life. Oh my gosh. Huh? That's the I first time he said something like that. I cannot imagine why anyone would risk their life to lie on another's behalf. Words from a true heartless robot. Emotions are only for meat bags. Oh my gosh. That is a harmful stereotype. I can produce heartfelt remarks through calculations. Like less than three? Those kinds of calculations? What? It's not so unthinkable. All hearts are blind when faced with radiant love. Doing anything for the one you What's love. What's up with bro right now? Hasn't everyone felt that way before? No. <laughs> Uh, you are. I'm sure that person didn't want your love. Uh, Kaede and Shuichi are pretty buddy buddy with each other, so I wouldn't doubt that. Plus, the way Kaede just acted right now, I'm pretty sure she lied. Oh. A talented liar like me can spot other people's lies easily. Okay. Oh, shoot. Well, what do you guys think? To believe or not to believe Kaede? What? Um, I do want to believe Kaede. But Shuichi does seem pretty suspicious. Because he's not saying he's anything, quiet right? For a while now, which is classic degenerate male behavior. Oh my gosh. Yeah. How is that? No, I no. agree. Shuichi is the only person here who's suspicious. So we all agree that Puichi did it. Y'all want, want to die, die bro? <laughs> oh my gosh, man. No, I still think it is too soon to determine the culprit. It is too soon. I agree. I sort of can't believe that Shuichi is the culprit. Yeah, this ain't right. I agree. But I don't know if Atua agrees. Cause right now it's his nap time. <laughs> hey, God might be tired sometimes. He'd be going to sleep sometimes, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> what? How are we supposed to decide? We're split right down middle. What split. the shit? Did you just say split? Oh, that's his whole personality. You know, did. I heard it. I heard it with my belly button microphone. That's what so that is. So wait, your ears don't do anything? The Ultimate Academy is proud to present its very own more phenomenal trial grounds. More phenomenal trial grounds? The trial grounds are gonna morph? What? Seriously? I totally want to see that! Either way, we have to do something. We can't vote for Shuichi because he's definitely not the culprit. If we vote for him, all hope is lost. And we all get clapped! I wonder, I won't be able to save everyone. But I haven't lost, I haven't lost hope yet. I won't give up. Before I can save everyone, I need to make sure we're all on the same page. Just split down the middle. At times like this, debate scrums are perfect. What the hell is this? Then you make your argument, or you make you argue your opinions against each other. But look, everyone's so fired up that the subjects or your statements don't match. All right, uh, the explanation is kind of confusing. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, this is kind of cool. Uh oh. What? I'm not even gonna ask. This is Danganronpa. Ropa. I'm not even gonna ask. I'm not even gonna ask. This is crazy! <laughs> they even lifted up the dead body. I can't. Or the dead one. Is she, is she the... Whoa! Whoa! You hid what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. Unlike Shuichi, I actually have an airtight alibi. What? Shuichi and Kaede weren't together the whole time, weren't they? Kibo! Kaede is the one who actually had the receiver. Wait, no. <laughs> if no, Shuichi no. had the receiver, it could have been discovered. Kibo! Oh, okay. Kaede is the one who actually had the receiver. Yeah. Yep, that's it. But that's Boom. Kaede's lie, isn't it? You hid what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. I get this, I get it. 
I, if our points don't match, then we won't be able to make a convincing argument. You hid what you knew about the camera interval, Shuichi. Gota. Okay, Gunta. Okay. But Mew was silent about intervals too. Right, right. I'm Boom. Like Shuichi, I actually have an air title. Boom. Kaede backed up Shuichi's alibi. Didn't Is she? that right? Okay. Shuichi and Kaede went together. Boom. Boom. Yep. Both yep. Of them were together when okay, this is kind of hard. When you get the controls down, okay. If Shuichi had the receiver, it could have been discussed. Kibo. Kaede is the one who actually mm -hmm. had the receiver. Mm -hmm. Yep. Boom. Well, yep. Shut your little ass up. Shut your ass, ass up! Damn! Let's get it. <laughs> my, my, let's go, bro! That was hype. That was hype. That was good. That was good. Okay. Okay. If we vote Let's for go. Shuichi, we'll be making the wrong choice. Oh. And mm -hmm. if that happens, everyone will be executed. Right. I'm standing in my seat I right now, though. We won't let that happen, even if it costs me my life. Mm. Kaede. Yeah, it's just like Kaede said. Shuichi ate the culprit. Let's go. Going to believe in Shuichi too. Gentlemen always believe in friends. Mm. Well, if Shuichi's not our culprit, then who is? We've already exhausted all possible avenues. Yeah, of I, I don't know, bro. I still want to ride on like Gonta, pause, but I don't know. No all way. the evidence has been pushed there out has to be this way. Else we can discuss. We just gotta think, right, Shuichi? Huh? Shuichi. Even though you're not the culprit, you've been quiet for a while. Right? Are you just it's because thinking? Because realized something, huh? Oh. You're scared to reveal the truth. Mmm. <laughs> oh, he talking about the heat. When he revealed to that one guy, he already knows who it is. But he's scared to look into the eyes again. Oh, he already knows. He already knows. I thought so. Shuichi, answer me this. What kind of truth did you realize? Okay, things are getting good. Don't be scared to say it. Not just for me, but for everyone else. Please, face the truth. Hmm. The picture. Picture? Uh-oh. 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 The picture uh -oh. from the camera aimed at the hidden door just before the murder. Uh-huh. It was moved. I always thought it was suspicious, the way Rantaro was acting. Hmm? What's suspicious? If you look at the picture, it looks like Rantaro is trying to remove the camera. Mm -hmm. That must mean he noticed the camera we set up. Right. That's true. But when did he notice that? I believe it was when the camera took its first picture. Mm. The flash. Yeah, the flash. This picture was taken when Rantaro That's what I was thinking. I don't want to. I don't. Did I say anything about that? I was like, why is it like the flash is on or something? At that moment, something made him notice the camera. So he tried to remove it. That's when the bookcase closed. The sensor was triggered. Oh! That's when this picture was taken. If that is the case. We must find the reason why he noticed the camera. I know why. I know why. The flash. You're confusing everyone. Except me. I used to use those type of cameras. Yeah, I'm trying to tell you that's a flash. I've been contemplating what it could be. Why did he notice the camera? I know why. And the answer is in this picture. I see. She what she knows. Here's why. Yeah. The camera flash. I get it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I got two hearts left. I'm about to die. Because of the flash, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. The way the shadows are, bro, that's not natural. Unless it's a flash. Yes. The flash went off when the hidden door camera took a picture. Rantaro noticed the camera's flash. But how can you tell the flash went off? Well, if you compare it to the other pictures that we have. Remember the pictures that were taken when I took down the cameras? This is the picture taken when I removed the front camera. Mm. This is the picture. Oh, my bad. <laughs> mm -hmm. And this is the picture of Rantaro. 
Whoa! The brightness is totally different. Right. Same room, circumstance, and camera. And yet, there is a disparity in brightness. Because only the camera aimed at the hidden door had the flash turned on. Mm. What was the purpose of leaving the flash on? Especially since it was meant to be hidden. A mistake, maybe? It's no mistake. There was an objective here. That camera was placed for another reason. Another reason, huh? To light up the room? To blind him? No, it would be no point. Yeah. To take a picture to lure the mastermind closer. Yeah. I get it. I guess, yeah, I guess. I mean, I don't know why, like, it would matter the if the light- was used to lure whoever moved the bookcase to the camera. Mm-hmm. So when the flash went off, they would have noticed the camera right away. Mm. And that's exactly what happened. Rantaro moved the bookcase, noticed the flash, and then walked over to the camera. But the culprit didn't expect the camera to take another picture when the door closed. Hey, Kaede? What is it? Is something wrong? You've been acting kind of strange. Strange? What? Your last few remarks carry more conviction than before. Do you know who the culprit is? I do. Yep, I know. I <laughs> hmm? Long You see how he reacted? Because there was only one person able to set the flash on the camera. Isn't that right, Shuichi? The culprit of this incident is... <laughs> oh. oh, wait, what? Huh? Wait, what? I don't understand. Wait, if wait, what? Who killed? What? Kinda I What? I'm so confused. Who's the killer? I don't know. If it's not Gunsa, then who? I I'm trying to I really don't know right now. I don't know. Wait, what? No doubt about it. What? Hold the fuck up. I'm not No. No, 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 no. Well, this is as far as it goes. What do you mean? What do you mean? I couldn't do it. I couldn't get to the mastermind. Wait, what? I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry, Rantaro. I'm sorry, Shuichi. Wait, what? You stayed silent this whole time because you realized it already, right? But you can't do that. It may be the end of me, but I want my wish to. I'm giving it to you, Shuichi. What? From now on, you're going to carry on my wish. You're going to protect everyone. Kaede, I know what you- What is going on?! That's so cool. It's cool, but I understand. I'll do it. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you? Don't do this. You can trust me. I won't let your wish go ungranted. I swear on everything I know and love right now. Kaede is the No!
You gotta be joking me right now, man. Tell me y'all lying, bro. Tell me y'all lying right now. Tell me y'all are lying right now. Tell me y'all are lying right now, bro. Y'all playing with me right now. Don't do this to me again. Don't do this to me again. Auto. How? How? Kaede did it? No way! Wait, that's not possible. Right, Kaede? Kaede? Mmm. <laughs> Don't do this, bro. Wait, did she really? <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Huh? Did you guys really think I'm the culprit? Shh, come on, guys. Like I could. When Rantaro was murdered, I was in the classroom with Shuichi, remember? After that, we went to the library, and that's the first time I even saw his body. Plus, I never met up with Rantaro. I never had a chance to kill him. Yes, no way Kaede could be culprit. Jeez, of course not. Do you think I'm even strong enough to throw that shot? My hands are only strong enough to play piano. Then accusing you of being the culprit is... <laughs> yep, it's wrong. Shuichi's just joking around. He wanted to lighten up the mood. What is going on right now, bro? Right, Shuichi? No matter how you look at it, I couldn't have killed Rantaro with that shot. I think everyone is afraid of learning the truth. But the people who are willing to find the truth are the ones who can decide their fate. If you never know the lies, from the truth, then you can't choose a path. You won't even know you're on a path. So fight for the truth, even if it is frustrating. I know you can do this. If you're scared, borrow the strength from others who will be there to help you. Think of everyone you're helping and let that be your strength. No, I'm not joking around. Kaede definitely killed Rantaro. Why does this happen every time, bro? What the hell did you just say? Why does this happen every time, bro? Why does this happen every time? It seems as though Shuichi is serious after all. Of course I am. Why don't you tell me then? How did I kill Rantaro with that shot? Wow! Why? Why? There's no, there's, 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 there's no way, there's no way right now. How Kaede killed Rantaro with the shot put ball should become clear when you consider where she used it. Where she used the shot put ball? Huh? What? I'm the protagonist? She wants me to make. She wants to, she wants to, she, I can't, I can't even like put my words together right now. She trusts me with her wish, so I can't back down. I need to fulfill her wish. I need to fight for the truth. You have to be f joking me right now. I have an alibi. When Rantaro was killed, I was in the classroom standing watch with Shuichi. Kaede never okay. saw Rantaro. How she kill him? It's important to establish where the culprit used the shot. We know that it was in the library. Oh my god. That's wrong! Oh, it's wasted his thinking! Kaede didn't use the shot put ball at the scene of the crime. She used it at the first floor classroom. Where we How? Keep the watch. Hold on. How could she have hit Rantaro with a shot from a different floor? She rolled it. She rolled the shot from the first floor classroom and hit Rantaro. I am skeptical that she could perform such a feat of accuracy. My mind is blown! So it was a magic shot put ball? Yeah. That's not possible. It is possible. 
If you do it at the right spot in the classroom, it will reach the library. So it seems you already knew about that. I'm playing as you! How did you do it? She couldn't no, I can't turn away from the truth. The place you go the ball to move it from the classroom to the library. I know this. The vent. Hangman combat. Okay, okay. Hang hang Oh my gosh, bro. Wait, what? Hold up. I get it, I get it, I get it. Oh my gosh, this game. No, man. Come on, bro. The classroom's bent. If you were to roll the shot in there, it would reach the library. It would. I see. That air depth connects the classroom to the library. So, the shot is rolled into the vent, passes I, I didn't even mean to skip that. And comes out of the air vent above the library bookcase. But how could she have hit Rantaro from all the way over there? Right. I don't, I don't even know that. The vent was way too far from Rantaro's body. I think I know how, but if so they ask me... it was just me, a coincidence? That doesn't... What kind of coincidence is that? Hmm. What a mystery. No, I already know the answer to that as well. It's no coincidence. Culprit set it up that way intentionally. If I remember correctly, there was something off about her then. Damn it, how could I not realize it? It's too late to regret the past. I said I wouldn't back down. I made a promise. I... What the fuck? The shot that fell from the vent. I know exactly what it is. Bro. How did it strike Rantaro's head from that distance? Yeah, that's impossible. It's not like it started rolling on its own. But it fell off the book. Yeah. It's not like it started rolling on its own. There we go. I agree. Oh my gosh, it did, it wouldn't hit it. All right. I. <laughs> It's just like we almost said. It is. The shot rolled along the top of the bookcase and fell on Rantaro's head. It rolled along the bookcase? I did say that, but would the shot have rolled that conveniently? It has nothing to do with convenience. The shot rolled exactly how the culprit wanted. They used books on top of the bookcases to direct the path of the shot. The shot's path was directed <laughs> by books? How would that even work? She puts the vent. She puts the vent in, and then look how she set up all the books. I was wondering uh, why she did it that. It's easier to explain with a floor plan of the library. Yeah, in fact, it might be counterproof in my theory. Mm. Miyu, Kurumi, Kibo. No, no, no. That's it. Oh, it was Miyu. Okay, okay. Didn't she take pictures of the Damn, drone? I recall that during yep, the Yep, yep, she took pictures with the drone, yep. Yep! You said you would use your drone to make a floor plan. Oh yeah! What happened with that? Ha! I've already developed the photos and drafted some sketches. And let's look at it. Maybe we all find clue. Please, Mio. Oh, want him that badly, huh? Fine. But now you owe me one. Voila! Feast your eyes on these babies. Damn, she do this? <laughs> oh my gosh, look at it. Look! Oh my gosh! It's just as I thought. Hmm? What is? Oh! No! The books are stacked like stairs from the vent to where Rantaro's body was found. Oh, Shuichi is right. Indeed. Oh, she didn't draw that. Like she didn't draw that. She just I did not it. notice when I looked up from the floor. I see, I see. The shot rolled on top of these books, eh? Yes. I'm sure of it. The shot was rolled into the classroom bin and came out in the library. 
If the vent was open, the shot would have maintained momentum. And you did that, right, Kaede? You made sure the vent was open. Like I said, she pushed the gear. Oh my gosh, and I looked at my body and looked inside. So how's it look? Could a person fit in there? Hmm, it would be pretty difficult, but you might be able to crawl through. Impressive. You have a really good memory, Shuichi. When the shot came through, the stacked books made it change direction. It then rolled down the path made by the books. The books were stacked in rows so that the shot wouldn't fall off. At the same time, the books blocked the shot from view. Then, when the ball was directly above Rantaro, it changed direction, rolled along the groove of the open books, and fell on top of his head. And it was the camera flash that lured him to that exact spot. A setup that complicated is almost like a Rube Goldberg machine. So Kaede created this mechanism? Well, it would be... Wait, even with the Rube whatever setup, when did she roll the ball into the duct? That's right! Wasn't Shuichi with Kaede in the classroom? Huh? Can she... Oh no! And she was leaving? That's it! Oh, okay, I mean... The moment we ran out of the classroom. When the sensor went off, I ran out first. And then Kaede followed. But just mm. before she left... I don't want to do this anymore. Hmm. <laughs> Someone moved the bookcase. Hurry, Kaide. Suichi's quick. Wait for me. I'm right, aren't I, Kaede? Of course, the ultimate detective would remember all that. Your words and that smile. Is this your admission of guilt? Hold on! Don't just jump to conclusions! I've still got a lot of questions! <laughs> That's weird! Why do you sound so desperate? There's nothing weird about it! There's just no way I could believe someone like Kaede would be the culprit! Yeah, Gonta not believe it either! What? Don't worry, Kaede! I'll clear your name! I refuse to believe that Kaede is the culprit. I still have my doubts. What kind of doubts? I can't. Doubts remember. about the noise, of course. The library should have been quiet, right? If that shot was rolling through the vents. I got it. I got it. It would have made a ton of noise. Indeed, so much noise. My car would have heard. Yeah, some noise in the video. I refuse to believe that Kaede is the culprit. I still have my doubts. That's about the noise, of course. Library should have been quiet, right? Yep. That's the, yep, the music, bro. The music is too loud in the back. Everyone was like, literally, like deaf from it. They said the murder occurred while the Killing Game promotional video was being broadcast, so the library would not have been completely quiet at the time. So that ghastly video drowned out the sound of the shot rolling. What? Kaito, are you done now? D damn it. So it's true then? You're saying Kaede really is the culprit? 
So that means most of Kaede's sins were committed right before Shuichi's eyes. That's correct. I was with her in the classroom. And when she moved the vent grate aside. And when she lined up the books on top of the bookcase. The top of the bookcase is covered to the end with a cluster stack of books. This is nothing. Then move the ladder, reorganize the books bit by bit. Geez, there's so many books, it might get hard to set up the camera here. Hmm, I thought so. Wait, I just gotta try a little harder. Kaede, I, I know you're not like to admit defeat, but it's really alright. Okay, I need to move in the ladder as I kept reorganizing the books. And it was the same when you took the murder weapon, wasn't it? You took the shot put ball when you got the cameras for Mew, right, Kaede? Something wrong? Now the door waiting for me. Oh, sorry. One of the things I was holding my. She literally said it. She literally said it, bro. It it never said she dropped the shot put ball. It never said she like put it down. It never said she left it or none of that. It just said she picked it up, and as she said it was heavy, and then she said I shoved the things I was holding into my backpack. Everything. Dude, it was right there. I ha So you were hiding it the entire time? Where would she have even hidden it? Book bag, man. Backpack. That's it! Kaede's backpack. She was carrying the shot put ball in there. Despite its weight, it would have been easy to carry in a backpack. I noticed you also had a spare vest, which you could have wrapped it in. That would prevent the cameras you were carrying from being damaged. And that means all of this happened right in front of Shuichi. But we should not blame him for that. None of those actions warranted suspicion at the time, so we might not have noticed. That clears it all up then. Every part of the crime Kaede plotted. That can't be. It's gotta be mistake, right? But if all of that is true, then that's pretty unfortunate. I mean, it's Kaede, you know? She kept preaching about working together, and then she goes and kills in cold blood! No, something still doesn't fit. Hmm? What doesn't fit? Kaede wouldn't do something like that. Huh? You mean she's not the type? But you were the one that said she did it, right? Yes, I did say that. But murder and cold what blood now, is bro? just not in her character. What? I truly believe that. But why? Why do you still believe in me, Shuichi? Why? Tell me why! Why are you doing this? Are you still looking away from the truth? Not at all. My belief in you. I, I'm speechless. I can't. It's going to lead me to the truth. I'll show you what's behind all this. I'll show you your truth. Oh my gosh, your opponent. Argument error er, mammoth mode. They move your error mammoth to refute what they're saying. What the actual what? You still believe in me? I'm definitely the culprit. Okay, okay. You think I wouldn't do it? It's all my fault! Oh my gosh. I'm the one who killed Rantaro. That's the truth this of this cool. case. Okay. And that's all there is to it. I'm a terrible murderer. I betrayed everyone. I'm the one who killed Rantaro. Please stop. Just stop. Remember what I told you? You have to fight for the truth. Luigi, I know you can do this. If you say you believe in me, then... Don't look away from the truth. 
Please stop. Just stop. Remember what I told you? You have to fight for the truth. Shuichi, I know you can do this. Mastermind. Please stop. Do you know what I was trying to do? You weren't persuaded by Monokuma, and you weren't trying to save yourself. What you were trying to do was kill the Mastermind. Oh. Kill the Mastermind? Kaede wasn't targeting Rantaro. She was targeting the Mastermind. She was trying to end this killing game. She was trying to save us all. Isn't that right, Kaede? I see! Otherwise, everyone would have died when the time limit expired. So, she tried to end the killing game by killing oh the Mastermind? Gosh, man. But it's all my fault. Kaede trusted my detective skills. I told her the Mastermind might be there. Mm. And that's why she set that trap. She believed him so it's much. My fault. She trusted my detective. Damn. And I screwed it up. Stop. It's not true. Please, don't say it's your fault. It'll be harder for me. None of this is your fault. It's mine. Everything's my fault. Kaede. Shuichi, can I ask you to do one last favor for me? Can you... End all of this. What? I want you to reveal everything that happened and convince everyone. Oh my gosh, bro. The closing argument. And then, I want you to end this. That's my final What is wish. this? <laughs> what? I understand. I'll end all of this. Bro, I, I have no energy left. I'll reveal screen, everything. Man. I don't. The truth and the lies. I can't. Wait. Who wanted to fight against Monokuma? Boom. Bro, man. Why are they making her, like, seem like an, like someone evil? That one. Oh, my eye, bro. Here's that one. That one. The killer game. Yep. And then that. This is the truth of the case. Oh, the game. I can't. It all began two days prior when Monokuma gave us the additional motive. The time limit added to this killing game triggered the crime. Oh, that's too slow. I'll get myself. After the announcement, some of us decided to form groups to plan our next move. I had my own plan to find the Why did make her look like the villain, man? That doesn't make no sense. At the time, I never would have imagined they would become the culprit. To expose the mastermind, the culprit and I set up hidden cameras in the library. There was a hidden door in the library that showed signs of use. We deduced that the mastermind would return there to let Monokuma out. The next day, we asked Mew if she could modify some cameras for our trap. But she did have high heels, after all. I didn't we know that. We then went to the warehouse to gather the necessary materials. All we needed were disposable cameras and a security sensor. But the cold Look how they got her looking! Damn! weapon. That's right, the shot put ball. They put the cameras as well as the shot in their backpack. Then, on the day the time limit would expire, the day of the murder, the culprit and I collected the modified cameras from you and visited the library. 
Once there, we searched the room for ideal locations to place the cameras. But even then, the culprit was preparing the murder. I wanted to be Zagunta so bad, bro. Oh my gosh, man. They began no way by removing they did the that. vent grate and laid it inside the air duct. Then, they moved the pile of books on top of the bookcase, pretending to organize them. After that, they placed open encyclopedias on the final bookcase. It appeared innocuous enough, but it was actually a path for the murder weapon. The culprit also tampered with the hidden camera linked to the security sensor. I was responsible for setting up the other cameras, but that one... Oh my god. I didn't even notice their trick. They used duct tape to keep the flash function on. Mm. After the cameras... Can you just hurry up? I don't even want to... and I climbed the stairs to the first floor classroom. I can't, man. We kept a lookout for the others and waited for the security sensor to go off. During the stakeout, we saw Kaito and six others go down to the basement. Rantaro was with them, the first victim. After watching that group enter the game room, I returned to the classroom. With about one hour remaining, the security receiver I was holding went off. I assumed it was the mastermind, so I ran out of the classroom to the library. I was in such a hurry, I left the culprit behind. Looking back on it now, that was the last chance I had to stop the murder. After I had left, why do they have the her looking the evil, bro? Out of that backpack. pisses me off. And rolled it into the she classroom vent. Like a damn this bowling ball, man. Motion. Rantaro had moved the bookcase, triggering the receiver. Unbeknownst to him, the trap had been sprung. First, the modified camera took a picture of Rantaro with the flash on. Rantaro noticed the flash and approached the bookcase to inspect the camera. The camera flash lured Rantaro directly into the murder weapon's path. The shot the culprit tossed into the vent That's rolled crazy, the air man. That is insane. Look at that, the bro. Look how perfect that looks. And kept opening the vent grate and organizing the books was all to create a path. Under normal circumstances, the victim would have been alerted by the noise. But the promotional video was masking the sound of the shot rolling. Look at that, bro. The shot oh my kept gosh. rolling, then fell on Rantaro's head killing him instantly. By the time we had entered the room, the murder was complete. That's why Kaede was so quiet, bro. She was like in such in shock, like. I imagine seeing Rantaro's yeah, body. Yeah, yep, the that's what I said. Probably thought, the mastermind is dead, the game is over. Now we can all go home. But their wish didn't come true because Rantaro wasn't the mastermind. It was murder in an attempt to save all our lives. That is the truth. That's the truth behind your lies, Kaede Akamatsu, the ultimate pianist. Oh my gosh, bro. And that concludes 
the events of this case. No. Kayede did it? Damn it! It is a truth I do not wish to accept. But since Shuichi has brought everything to light, we can at least try to trust the Kaede we've come to know up to this point. The Kaede we've come to know? Even if she did commit a crime, what Kaede has said to us is not a lie. She wanted to protect us. And I firmly believe that to be the truth. If that was a lie too, it'd be the last straw for me. I'd have nothing left to believe in. You guys are so nice. Even though I betrayed you all. No, that's not true, Kaede. You were trying to save all nice of us. Nice job, Shuichi. I didn't expect any less. What? You were super reliable back there. Oh my gosh. But you still have a long way to go. You need to be more assertive. If you did that more often, you'd be a pretty cool guy. What the f- Kaede. Why? Oh my gosh, gosh man! Why are you smiling like that? Why are you still trying to get me to be brave? Because why would she smile? Or why wouldn't she smile? The last time she, he did this, to, like, reveal, like, the killer, the killer looked in his eyes and he couldn't forget it. She's trying to give him the last, she's trying to give him a smile. Why, Kaede? Why are you thinking about everyone except yourself? If you had just been less selfless, he wouldn't have had oh the murder. Oh my gosh, dude. Why? Why do you do that? Oh my. I'm sorry. Stop, stop, stop! At least save it for the end of the trial! Sheesh! <laughs> Looks like the debate's finished, so that- Shut your ugly asses up. I don't even care. Yes, burning! Yeah, fuck off, bro. Golly, bro. <laughs> it seems the voting is finished. Now then, let's see the result. My heart's beating so fast. I don't. I do not. I don't want to know how she dies, bro. Golly, man. Chosen as the blackened. Will you make the right choice or the dreadfully wrong one? good about this at all bro I don't, I don't even care if i got like an s plus man i don't give a damn absolutely right well at this point it goes without saying but you all voted correctly the black who killed rentaro amami is the ultimate pianist kaede akamatsu i'm glad good what what good don't screw what around. do you mean good? Is this how you wanted to end? That's not true. Not really, but it could have turned out a lot worse, so this is fine too. I don't get it! It's not fun! This is super horrible! The worst ever! <laughs> yeah, how did it come to this? Please! Kari, what will possess you to do something like this? <laughs> Going to no no can accept this unless you can unless you explain Real. it. We just explain though. I wouldn't be I won't be satisfied until I hear trust you. Oh. Hey! Kari, please. And he's in the spot she was in now. Okay, please allow me a few more moments with your time then. It's just like Shuichi said, I was after the mastermind this entire time. I wanted to kill the mastermind and I thought doing that would end the killing game. But, but why did you try to kill them? Maybe they could have been captured. Um, if I hadn't been for the time limit, I probably would have done that. But the time limit meant that capturing the mastermind was less likely to work, you know? Because the mastermind could have just played dumb to run out the clock and kill us all. Yeah. 
I was worried about that happening. Therefore. So you sought to kill the mastermind instead. That's right. I had made up my mind before we set, the, set up the cameras in the library. I thought it was my last chance to save, save everyone. I couldn't let that chance slip me by. I just save everyone, no matter what. Yeah. Even if you had to kill someone? Yeah. That's right. I thought that killing the mastermind was the best shot at escaping this place forever. I... I really believed it, too. Kaede. But... Oh, Kaede, it never dawned you. As soon as you t thought... Uh, as soon as that thought entered your head, Monokuma had you right where he wanted. Because what mattered most to Monokuma is that the killing game started. You really don't Regardless of it. your actions, the moment you felt the urge to kill, you had already lost. You agreed to, the, to be part of this killing game when you allowed murder in to fill your heart. Wait. Wait, to put it like that... <laughs> But he's not wrong. She's the reason the killing game finally started. Uh, no. I want to curse her out so bad. But if Kaede hadn't done anything, we'd all be dead by now. Right. Kaede saved everyone. We know can blame her. I know that. I know. You don't need to remind me. That's why I'm so pissed. Oh, my gosh. Um. Okay, that's enough. I can see that you're at. Man. This bitch. This fucking little. Oh, sorry. That's right. So, Kokichi is right. I was being played. And I didn't even kill the mastermind. I killed one of our dear friends instead. What I did was so terrible, so unforgivable. I took an innocent life. I'm nothing but a horrible murderer. You should all hate, blame, and be disgusted by me. Wait! Kaede, please calm down. Uh. After we found Rintaro's body, when I realized he wasn't the mastermind, I thought about ending this by confessing to for confessing to you what I had done. But I couldn't because of Monokuma's first b blood perk. Your, I say, if you confessed there, and then you'd be able to leave. But you decided you couldn't leave this place by yourself, so you kept quiet. Because of the first blood perk, you were first forced to hide the truth from us. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. I see. So the first blood perk worked against the black and rather than for them. Uh. But at the same time, I thought if I did this for everyone, then instead of making things easier by confessing, I thought I should lie to you all so it would motivate you to keep moving forward. Then? Is that the reason for the trial? To reveal the mastermind? Because... I felt like if I had, if I didn't do this, then Rotaro's death would have been meaningless. Well then. We were searching for the culprit and the mastermind during the class trial. Yeah! Kaede did mention that. But that's why I wanted to end all of the terrible things happening to us. I'll defeat the mastermind and end this dumb killing game. I I'll even use the class trial to do that. Oh my gosh. I never wanted to keep my crime a secret. I was going to tell you all eventually. But I, before I did, I wanted to expose the mastermind first. And the killing game would have ended, and everyone but me would be saved. Uh, I thought that was, I thought that was the best way I could atone for killing Rintaro. Sorry. This is my fault. I was wrong. There was no mastermind. What? You were wrong. But didn't you say the mastermind was one of us? Uh, okay. That's what I thought at first, but in the end, we have nothing. No one made any moves at the time limit. The trial was useless. Let's see. Even when Shiyuchi was about to be voted as the blackened. Still, they did not appear. Maybe. Yes, that seriously was a close one. If Kaya just had kept her mouth shut, we'd all be dead by now. No way, there has to be something else we can discuss. We just gotta think. Right, Shuichi? But... On the other hand, she's only in this mess because she decided to say something at that moment. That's... I wanted to protect Kaya, but I also wanted to unmask the mastermind. But even when the killer was about to be condemned, they remain hidden. Sorry. That has to mean that the mastermind is not among us after all. What? So Kaede had the wrong idea the whole time? I see. All her actions were taken under Shuichi's flawed logic. Uh, okay. That's why this is my fault. All this happened because my detective work was wrong. If I hadn't been so stupid, if I never had said anything about a mastermind to Kaede, the child wouldn't have died and Kaede wouldn't be a murderer. This is all my fault. That's wrong! No, it's not! Huh? Kaede? Because... I killed him, not you. Right? Right? Didn't I? But... Kaede, why did you set such a con convoluted trap? If your intent was just to kill the mastermind, there was no reason for you to cover your tracks. Jeez. It's an obvious. It's because she didn't want Shuichi to know. Huh? Me? Yeah. Of course, but I didn't want everyone else to know either. Because I wanted to escape this place with everyone. Because... But you guys wouldn't want to be friends with a girl who killed someone, would you? <laughs> be friends? <laughs> Kaya put a lot of thought into this. Mm. She put so much thought into this, it drove her to commit murder like a lunatic. <laughs> You're such a dumbass. Yeah. I know, right? I'm such an idiot. However... 
We only survived the timeline because of that idiocy. idiocy. Right. Yes, we're still alive thanks to you. Kari, <laughs> I didn't know how, but I wanted to get out of here with you. I wanted to be friends. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn. So you're saying everything you did was because you were thinking of us? And you hid that you just you killed him just to stay and help us? How did things Hi, hello! Alright, alright, that's it. <laughs> what? What do you mean? What? what do you mean that's it? Ah. Father, you're getting bored. That's right. <laughs> Punishment. Yeah, bro. No freaking way. There's no way we'll let you do that. Hey! Punishment time is a sacred segment. You're not allowed to interfere. And if you even try to interfere, we'll just crush you with these here exosols. It's cool, but... It's probably better if one person dies instead of everyone. Like hell am I just gonna sit here and do what you say? Let me just get the thumbnail. I, I got Kaede you, bro. Kaede fought with her life on the line, and so will I. Gonta will face you all. Times like this are why Gonta became strong. Gentlemen never back down, and neither will Gonta. This is the perfect chance to test out my Neo Aikido skills on machines. Yeah, I'll help. I can... Everyone, stop! Stop it. Kaede. I... Enough, you guys. I've already prepared myself. You're giving up? Why? You said you never give up. <laughs> okay. You good. Then we get out of here together. That's what you said, Kaede. Damn it! So why are you giving up now? Did you mean what you said? I know we can do something. Don't give up to the end. No. I'm not giving up. Because I have you. Huh? What? You know? Even after I'm gone, my wish will stay here. We'll still be here. So I'm counting on you all. I'm entrusting my wish to every one of you. I believe in you! Man, that music. Oh my gosh. I believe that you all will make it through this somehow. You have don't you go don't go dying on me now in this ridiculous killing game survive and get the hell out of this place it's a promise and then be friends after you escape okay i think you all be the best of friends yeah affirmative kaide i shall take that request i will do my utmost to fulfill your final request <laughs> i won't give up i'll get out of here no matter what <laughs> go to work hard and keep friends safe till the very end bye well kaide you definitely weren't born well now now then, I've prepared a very special punishment. For the ultimate pianist, Kaede Akamatsu. Damn it! Wait a second, Kaede, please don't. Hey. Chi Chi, you better not lose. You can't lose! To this killing game, I know you can beat it. It's punishment time! I believe in you! So please believe in yourself. It's a promise.
Yeah. Mm-hmm.